Hey guys, Nocturne here. <laughs> I was waiting for the song to end. Hey everybody, uh, welcome to my 200th stream. Uh, that song is from the official Dynamite Heady soundtrack, and it is a official vocal theme for the game itself. Uh, as you can see, I need to make a quick adjustment with something. So let me just... Pull that out. Let's make sure it's all nice and square. Okay. So, uh, stream number one, I played Dynamite Heady and beat it. The Japanese version. I think I got three. I think it was a three th credit clear. Stream number 50. I played the Japanese version and got a one credit clear. Uh, 100. I tried the US version. I wasn't able to beat it. And then stream number 150. I got a one credit clear on the American version. So now it's stream number 200. And we're going to play the Master System version of Dynamite Heady, which was a exclusive to Brazil. It's a port from the Game Gear version. So you see, 1986 was when the Master System came out, but the game uh, came out in 1995. <laughs> The Saturn and PlayStation were out by then. So we got a story. And yes, even though this game uh, is in Brazil, was Brazil exclusive, it's still all in English. <laughs> I might. <laughs> Who knows? Hey, Met Man, good to see you. So here's our story. And this is a lot different from the Genesis version. I mean, it's a lot shorter. You know, the graphics are a bit downgraded, but they still look really good. second I don't seem to have <laughs> a pause button so just give me one moment while I set up my controller Oh, thank you. Thank you for the bits. I really appreciate it. And thank you, Twitch, <laughs> for adding. <laughs> yes, thank you, Twitch. I appreciate it. Yes, thank you. I really appreciate it. There we go. Now I can pause the game. Whereas on the Master System, originally, uh, the pause button was on the console itself. So you can see there's no uh, collector robot here. It's just the spikes and the planes. And here's the main difference. Uh, it's not Mariama in this one. It's Trouble Bruin. And he is pretty much the main antagonist until the end. He's not someone who just shows up every now and then. 
Uh, he actually takes the place of the key masters in this game. So there's no tutorial for anything. And there's no way to cancel your head either, so you have to wait. There we go. Gets rid of that so I can move on. Whoop. <laughs> Controls are a little slippery, as you can see. So it, it follows similar to the Genesis game, but not quite. So we still get the sleep one, which heals us. That gets you a full heal. Although you notice, we got these from level 4 in here. And it's these guys. They're still upset when they get impaled, but they don't actually die. They just frown. <laughs> Damn it. Now, we're already uh, in the backstage area from level 4. And now we got this boss from 1-1 one, one to deal with. And as you can see, uh, you take shitloads of damage in this game. <laughs> There's the doll head. There we go. I don't know what these stars do. I think they're just points. Ah, and here's the replacement for the Mad Dog boss fight. <laughs> you have to hit Trouble Bruin as he jumps from side to side. Yeah. And not bad in 8-bit. There we go. We got him. And no Heather either. <laughs> It's just you. And there's secret bonuses as well. I'm not gonna really bother with those. And now we're already at the underground area. Of course, they can't do that same effect. Uh, 
in the Japanese version, it's Mariyama. And in this version and the U.S. version, it's Trouble Brewing. Because uh, he has a cat head, but a bear body. Like, in you, when you fight him in the first level, in the Genesis version, his regular body is called his Kuma body. And, of course, Kuma means bear in Japanese, so... When they brought, when they localized it, they just made his name Trouble Bruin to make a pun. A bear-based pun. Oh, got him. <laughs> and just in the nick of time. So you can see they're doing their best to mimic the fights that you had. that was going to happen. This is a lot harder than the uh, American Genesis version. I'll say that much right now. That was my fault. Game over already. They do give you a continue, though, at least. I don't know how many continues I get. But let's try to be a little more careful. <laughs> Or we could just blow it again, like, right at the start, like we did before. So here's Snake Eyes, as he was called in the American version. However, I prefer the Japanese name of this thing. Uh, happy cum cum. Just kill me. <laughs> Jesus Christ, just kill me. How embarrassing. Okay. 
Okay. was that okay so you get one continue good to know oh this is gonna shape up to be rare <laughs> this is gonna shape up to be a spectacular failure the story <laughs> so we're back here at 1-1 one, one. and I will say this the game is a hell of a lot shorter than the Genesis version I'm pretty sure there's only like five main levels. They don't even introduce you to the to the friend characters. They're just there. Okay. Let's keep it moving. say one thing about this version though there's no basketball bonus game which I'm very happy about <laughs> Our health is topped off. Although I don't think I'm taking a hit yet. The other thing I was considering doing for this, which I made a poll for, in the uh, Genesis version of Dynamite Hetty, you can input a code to make it so that uh, you take one hit deaths. And I was going to try to do that, try to do a 1cc of that version. Uh, the ja uh, the Japanese version with that hard mode for my 200th stream, but uh, this one out in the poll. I do want to try that one time though. On the Japanese version, of course. There's no way in hell I would attempt that with the U.S. version. Here. If I can get 
get it. Oh, I got it. Somehow. <laughs> There we go. Short work of that. That hammerhead comes in handy. Well, <laughs> the screen was shorter than I thought it was. It's random what crap falls from the ceiling. Whether it's the caterpillar or the two ball things there. Hmm. <laughs> well then. Good rhythm going now. There we go. Got him. Okay. Back to where I was. <laughs> Oh, hold on a second. Let me move that uh, goal thing. You can't even see it up there. There we go. That's a better spot for it. Okay, let's see if I can uh, do this without screwing up. <laughs> or not. Maybe I can just get uh, bounced around again. That is some enemy placement though, let me tell you. Use my continue already. Good. <laughs> Great. Good. Great and good. Okay. take our time. We saw what rushing got us, so let's actually take our time now. Thank you. 
Oh, I can keep getting this. Killer. There we go. Okay, uh, this boss really sucks. <laughs> because uh, you're stuck on this and you can't move. And when it slams you down, you have to take damage. <laughs> And sometimes it shoots out health, but it's completely at random. So you can't control uh, how this boss goes. Got him. But yeah, uh, that boss sucks. <laughs> and speaking of bosses that suck, here's the next Mario. Here's the next uh, Keymaster fight. It's the same principle. You're knocking the clothes off. Except, uh,. It's a little more difficult because it's such a huge sprite. Got him though. Okay. So you can see all the stuff they've cut out so far. It's a great deal. And look at this. It's the damn tower level. I got another continue somewhere along the line. So yeah, let's take our time with this. the tower. Now we're inside the tower. Let me pause for a second. Of course, there's no rotating effect 
like in the Genesis version. <laughs> Hit my mic there. Fun while it lasted. self-explanatory. It's doing its best for, you know, considering it can't do rotation. <laughs> it doesn't look bad. We have this one now. And instead of rotating, it just bounces around all over the damn place. tell you something about this boss this boss the first time I did it took me about an hour to figure out what the hell I was supposed to do because they don't tell you anything about it uh, it's the same concept as a spinderella or motor hand from the Genesis version you need to hit the battery in the back Unfortunately, uh, this boss always faces the front. So the dilemma is, how do I make the battery appear? Well, you don't do that. So what you need to do is lure it over here. So it hits the side, and then it exposes the battery. No, it's not close enough, and I'm gonna blow up. And yep, game over, of course. Alright, I'm gonna keep trying. But yeah, that, that boss was so difficult for me the first time I got there. 
because I could not for the life of me figure out how to get it. It's not like I was a kid either. <laughs> this was Brazil, this was Brazil exclusive and I didn't own a Game Gear, so. So it's not like I played this growing up. here again. Well, this is what we had to do. <laughs> what we had to do back in the olden days. Just keep plugging at a game over and over again. Playing the early levels constantly until you finally got it. find out what those stars do. Maybe if I collect enough of those stars, I get a continue or something. <laughs> try to make that jump in one shot again. So after every two hits, it attacks. That shit. There we go. It's the super tank thing. Which it always seems to be the third uh, bomb hits it. that. Okay, let's see if we can get through this boss without losing a life this time. I remember to walk. That one didn't, though. <laughs> Figures. Of 
course. <laughs> I have to actually hit it. There we go. Okay, so. Uh, we only lost, lost one life. Not bad. <laughs> I'm showing definite improvement. <laughs> Alright, we'll see if I lose all my lives here. Okay. Okay. Got through there without getting hit. That's a definite improvement. We'll see how we do over here. Hey, Pathy. Yep, this is Master System Dynamite Hetty. And it's kicking my ass. I've already had to start over, what, this is the third time? <laughs> it's proving to be a hell of a lot harder than the uh, American Genesis version. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I think I've game overed. I've game overed at least twice, if not three times already. Oh, hello, Ice Kitsune. Good to see you. Yep, this is the Brazilian exclusive Sega Master System version. Well, yeah, it looks, it came out in 1995. <laughs> I had a good handle on the system by then. There we go. Yeah, this was a, this was a port from the Game Gear version. Now we're at this stupid boss, <laughs> where I can't move or defend myself. I had gotten that health. Okay, I got him at least. But I really doubt I'm gonna make it very far in the next area. <laughs> Alright, let me pause this for a second. Okay, so here's the deal. I might have explained this before, but I'm gonna go over it again. Uh, basically in Brazil, uh, if you want to import something, the taxes are like a thousand percent or something like that it's some ungodly high number to import anything especially electronics so sega teamed up with a brazilian toy company called tech toy and just said hey how would you like to just make master systems here so that way you don't have to worry about importing anything else and tech toy said well that sounds fantastic sign me up so the Sega Master System lasted in Brazil until about 1997. In fact, they still make Master Systems in Brazil. They don't make new games for them anymore, but you can still get a Master System there. <laughs> and it lasted all the way until at least the 32-bit era, if not when the Nintendo 64 came out. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, Sega was big in Brazil because... If you were a pa if you were a Brazilian parent and you went into an electronics store and saw a Nintendo Entertainment System sitting there for like probably a few thousand dollars worth of 
your Brazilian money. And then you saw the Sega Master System sitting there for a fraction of the cost. You're going to get the Sega Master System. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> I knew that was going to happen. Yes, yeah, Se Sega was the only game industry in there. <laughs> For a long time. I don't know how it is now. I'm sure it's different now. So this boss is pretty easy. You just knock all the accoutrements off. And then hit him in the chest. And like I said, there's no key masters in this game. It's just, uh, Mariyama, or they call him Trouble Bruin in this version. They use his American name. Alright, now we're back to here. So we're right, we're already back to where we left off. And we're going to take our time here. Because of this stupid thing. Nope, almost made it. I only I only figured it out by accident. <laughs> I just hit it when it got near me. Whoops. That's not good. Alright, at least I made it here. Oh, uh, okay. Well, I can see that. I tried going really fast, and it didn't really get me anywhere. <laughs> you can stay right there, balloon thing. Yeah, I'm definitely not a speedrunner. <laughs> I just focused on Dynamite Heady because it's my favorite Genesis game. The Japanese version, at least. Because I've already 1cc'd the Japanese Genesis version and the American Genesis version. The American Genesis version was difficult. I'm just seeing if I can beat this one today. Boy, I, w I wish there was some health I could have. Oh, thank you! Oh, cool! Nice! Thank you for the gift sub, Pathy. And that's cool, Ice Kitsune. That's awesome. No, keep away. Yeah, I know, that's awesome. <laughs> Damn you. <laughs> Alright, well. It, we only used one continue so far getting up to here, which is a definite improvement over how I've been playing. <laughs> That's cool. Do you? <laughs> she could. Or they could. I don't want to assume anything. But, uh, I'll just keep plugging along. For right now. Oh, 
Okay. Alright, cool. Just let that go. Whoops. I missed the bus. There we go. Alright, back to the rolly guy again. Who doesn't quite roll in this version. <laughs> Lunges right at you. Nah, I knew that was gonna happen. <laughs> yeah, exactly. And he also never quite gets into the corner as well. Take a drink here. Okay, we'll let the balloon settle down there. Yes. <laughs> yep. I do like how they solve the problem, though, of not, you know, being able to do rotations and things like that. Although they handled it pretty well with the pillar there. You know, that's not a bad, that's not a bad point redeem idea. I might just do that. Oh, never mind, he made a liar out of me. He did hit the exact corner. Okay, I see. Okay. <laughs> I will I will say this once. Ice Kitsune. Do you have any pointers for this asshole right here? <laughs> I know how I know how to hit him. I know what I need to do. But it's extremely difficult to avoid his attacks. Okay. Okay. That makes sense. Excuse me.
Yeah, I know, right? Yeah, let's try this. Nope. <laughs> Guess not. See what? I'm having uh, troubles with that part. No, I understand. <laughs> oh well. Oh, I'm getting further. Okay. I'll try that when I get back to it. I'll try a couple more times and then, uh... If I can't, we'll shelve it for now, <laughs> and then I'll come back to it uh, later stream, when I do 250. <laughs> Thank you. But yeah, this is a very, yeah, this is a very short game, I know. It's only, I'm pretty sure it's only five levels. Like, five worlds, and then, you know, the stages therein. Ice Kitsune, uh, do you know what the stars do in this game? Okay, you can let me know when you get back. Ah, okay. That makes sense. Yes, thank you. Okay, yeah, sure. See you when you get back. Let's get some sleeps in. Okay, 
you can jump down ledges, that's good to know. <laughs> okay, there we go. I was about to say, this could be bad. Okay. Back to this boss. Which still has been giving me a little bit of trouble. any lives this time. We'll see if I can keep that momentum up. Hell yeah. <laughs> for this to run out because I don't want to be speeding around okay we're at the hook boss which I just got to pound relentlessly there we go got it Okay. 
And this boss is just about getting it done before they attack. That's right. Okay. We're rolling along now. Haven't lost a life yet. Okay. Spin. Understand patterns, yay! <laughs> oh, never mind. Okay. <laughs> well, we're back here again. Although I haven't lost a life yet, although that's about to change, I'm sure. <laughs> walked across. I'll keep trying it out and see. I was hoping you would hit the other side. Hell yeah! <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> well, 
Let's fucking go. Wow, this level. <laughs> this level's a nightmare. So this level is just a bunch of rooms, <laughs> like it says. See, we're at Dark Demon's Castle already. Welcome back! I made it to level 5. I'm in the room service level. I think I have to start all the way back. Yep. Why did I jump there? <laughs> okay. I think that was my first continue. So up, down, down. What do I do with these penguin guys? I ask while taking a drink. <laughs> okay. Fair enough. There we go. Okay, I can stun lock Taro. Okay, this guy's simple enough. This isn't gonna work. <laughs> I seem to have I seem to have the most trouble in that room with the strong men. Alright, I'm gonna take a quick break. I'll be right back. And sorry I got no music this time, but uh, I'll be right back. Yeah, the room service is terrible.
<laughs> okay, thank you for the head pats. And yes, this hotel is getting a one star review. <laughs> I forgot the jump part. I forgot the jump part again. Yeah. It's like, if I could no-star this place, I would. <laughs> could you imagine? Could you imagine? <laughs> giving a place negative stars? Muscle men. <laughs> but I like the mu I like muscle men. <laughs> okay, it appears inevitably I'm going to take three hits there. <laughs> The least I can do is mitigate any other damage. Never mind. Because apparently it's four hits and you're dead now. And I don't think that's the last room either. Yeah. I know. Get another continue. All right. I think I think it's time for one of my patented secret saves, <laughs> so we can lab this out. Okay, uh, hold on a second. <laughs> I forgot I gotta do this first. Yes. The secret forbidden technique. Okay. Pay no attention to those words on the bottom of the screen. I know, right? Alright, I'm gonna sit here and figure this out. <laughs> Hmm. Alright, 
right, hold on. Did I really got to do this every single time? <laughs> Why does it do this? I don't like it. All right, let me. <sighs> Fine. You son of a bitch. <laughs> you motherfucker. And I, I saw him, I saw his face take the hit as the screen was going black. <laughs> Hmm, there's an idea. Save that for later. See, the thing is, though, as soon as I hit it, I press the jump button, and since his head isn't fully retracted back, he doesn't jump. That's what I was thinking of. There we go. Alright. I'm not gonna fall for it this time. There. <laughs> now, this thing is easy enough.
Yeah, go to hell. <laughs> I'm not even bothering with you. <laughs> All right. Just in time to game over. <laughs> So, this one's pretty simple enough. Stay in the middle. Uh, when he comes by and he's green, you can hit him. When he's red, uh, move away. Another continue, you say? Sure, why not? Alright, if I gotta do it by going into a menu, fine. <laughs> Be that way. I care very little. <laughs> At least you can kind of tell where he's going to come from when he's the evil head. Oh, never mind. I was wrong. <laughs> he juked me. Okay. Well, uh, I think we're at the final boss. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no, we're not. I think. Wait, hold on. I'll tell you in a second. Nope. I forgot. There's this. Jumping too early. Okay, now we're at the final boss. <laughs> yep, here we are.
I'm gonna say, I know one of these is a sleep head. Now I'm going back to sleep. <laughs> No, you can't wake me up. <laughs> now I'm getting more sleep. <laughs> I'm gonna do this until my health is full. He's gonna hit one of these times where he doesn't do anything, and I'm gonna get my health back. See? <laughs> okay, I don't need the health yet. Haha! <laughs> that jump was completely <laughs> by accident because I had no idea it was gonna happen. this head. Okay, nothing. Nope, I didn't mean to hit it. I didn't mean to hit it that time. <laughs> Oops. Oh. <laughs> I just took all those out. There we go. I keep jumping too early for the lasers. sleeping. <laughs> Alright, never mind. Now I definitely need to sleep and get my health back. Nope. <laughs> I can keep this up just as long as you can, Dark Demon. on hitting that one by accident. Yay! 
course, not the same music as in the uh, Genesis version. that by accident. I'm taking my sweet ass time with this. <laughs> lucky with these so far. Because I don't know how you're supposed to dodge these attacks. <laughs> I know the color on this crystal ball tells you what's coming up, but I'll be damned if I can actually, you know, figure it out. He has a lot of health, too. I definitely need to heal. Yeah, I bet. <laughs> I would imagine so. It's a lot of learning. No, don't mind me. <laughs> Getting my health back. Not good. Not good at all. Okay, thank god. It was a blank phase. Alright, now I'm in trouble. Oh, thank god. Fuck! <laughs> Son of a bitch. All right. <laughs> All right, so yellow is the lasers. Red, I think, is the spikes, yep. a blank period. Greens, yep, those. I'm gonna keep at it. <laughs> Cause I know one of these is gonna be a uh, blank. And then when it's a blank, I'll get my full health back. Yep. 
Yellow. These lasers come very fast. No, there's no way. Oh, never mind. It's a blank phase. Still jump too late. See, that was by accident. <laughs> They're starting to come out of order now. I don't like it. There we go. Nothing. Okay, that was an accident. <laughs> okay, let's get some shut eye. <laughs> Almost. Okay, so there is a way to cancel your head. I just seem to do it by accident. So this is much, despite how it looks, this is much easier than the Genesis version, since you're allowed to, you know, regain health. <laughs> Be on the safe side. Yellow lasers. Green over here. Yes, progress indeed. Nope. <laughs> the left side for that one. Nothing.
And that's it. Not quite a 1cc, but we beat it. Thank you. Thank you for the GG's. Wow, that didn't take half as long as I thought it would. <laughs> See ya. <laughs> and we don't know who that is. <laughs> Cause there ain't been no real story. So Hetty defeated Dark Demon and restored peace to the town. I see you over there, trouble brewing. After such hard work, he could. Now relax and spend some time with his friends. Dynamite Heady Credits. <laughs> so yeah, that's Dynamite Heady for the Master System. I, c I could 1cc this if I gave it enough practice. If I, I think, I think by the time stream number 250 rolls around, I could probably 1cc this game. The only thing I would need to really practice on are those, like, penguin things in the one, uh, room service area. And the Spinderella boss. Because the Twin Freaks isn't difficult, you just have to really pay attention. Fatal Contraption is even easier, you j I just have to jump correctly. And Dark Demon isn't that bad in this version, considering you can heal. It just takes time. I, I would imagine the RNG on Dark Demon is probably difficult when you're speed running. E I E I O. <laughs> I love the fake names uh, game developers gave themselves in the credits so they wouldn't get poached by other companies. Because that's why. <laughs> that's why in this era, game credits had, uh, Game designers had such weird, bizarre names. Yeah, so other companies wouldn't come by and poach them from whatever company they were working for. Treasure. I miss treasure. I miss them so much. <laughs> no, that's his real name. <laughs> that that is not <laughs> that is not a pseudonym. That is his real name. It's, I think, I'm pretty sure the last name is pronounced, uh, Fucus. But yes, Fred Fox is a real name. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, hit. The game, since he was, since he made games that were mainly made in America, he didn't have to worry about it. So it was mostly Japan developed games that had companies do the thing. Yeah, it's some it's something like that. I 
I know it's certainly not fucks. <laughs> I'm pretty sure they would change their name if their last name was Fox. There's all the American credits. Yeah. The credits are just as long here. <laughs> As they are in the uh, American version of the game. The Genesis version. Yeah, there are. I think they pronounce it like Shithade or something like that. And thank you for making this version of the game. Oh, Sawthede. <laughs> 1995. So many good games came out in 1995. And then it just kicks you back to the title screen. Well. Stop that, please. Thank you. <laughs> That's the first time Fusion ever did that. Alright, well. Uh, that was all I had planned for today. And I think we're good to stop here. I do have to be up, not super early tomorrow, but I do have to be up early for work. Not like 5.30 in the morning early, uh, 8 o'clock in the morning early. So I think we'll stop here, first of all. Thanks for watching. Thanks for helping me get to 200 streams. Thank you for all the bits, the likes, the subscriptions, the follows, the head pats. And the support that you give, because I really appreciate it. I'm really happy. I know I say this all the time, and I sound like a broken record, but I'm really happy that you guys like watching me uh, fuck around with games and be shit at playing them. <laughs> so, if you're watching this on YouTube, this is where we part ways. So have a good night. Because I'm stopping the local recording. <laughs>